Hello community, I was just playing around here in chat GPT, no not GPT-4, and I created here an agent. And I said, hey, I want to be more creative in my life. And chat GPT created here one, two, three agent. And interestingly, it came up with here writing stories, engaging narratives, exploring interactive storytelling. And I said, this is the agent I would like to try out, so go. So ChatGPT comes back, says, "He, how we'll proceed. These are the steps we're going to do. And this is part in my prompt. I tell him, hey, show me what we're going to do. I want to know the strategy we're going to follow. So step one, setting the stage. Define the scope of your creative project. Step two, let's brainstorm for your narrative. What themes, what topics. Step three, to be a creative writer. Characters. Character development and characters are the heart of any narrative. Who are the protagonist, antagonist in your story? What are the motivation, conflicts? Step four, plot. A well-structured plot keeps the audience engaged. Yeah, world building. Depending on the settings of your narrative, will develop a world in which your story takes place. Cultures, history, great. Crafting engaging scenes. We dive into the art of crafting scenes that capture readers and viewers. Balance dialogue, description, and action to create a dynamic and immersive experience. Editing and refinement, finalizing and sharing the story. Interaction with the agent. This is in my GPT-4 in Ch Chat GPT prompt. I say, hey, give me the option that I can change something if I want. No. And summarize the process, you know, to combat forgetting with ChatGPT. It has a limited amount of token it can remember. I have here the summarization process where here the most important facts are summarized so that no forgetting happens. And it says, okay, let's start with step one, setting the stage. So step one is what I want to write. A short story, a novel, a screenplay, something else entirely. And I just go, I don't know, it just happened by accident. So I said, hey, a short story. And ChatGPT says, wonderful. Oh, so charming. A short story is a fantastic choice for our, for your creative narrative journey. So let's proceed with step one, setting the stage. The genre, what you want, what is the setting, where does your story take place, what is the main theme, what is the main uh, message, love, friendship, overcoming challenges, exploring human conditions. Feel free to provide your preference for these aspects. And we move on to step two. And I say, hey, I want to write about science fiction with a lot of, what? Space technology. My goodness, there are a lot of typos today. It is Sunday. I'm so sorry. But ChatGPT comes back, fantastic choice. A science fiction st short story with a focus on space technology. So even understanding all that in my typos, I great. Opens up a world of possibilities. Let's proceed with step two, ideation and concepts. So step two, remember here we are, ideation and concepts. Great. Now we step two. So based on your preferences, I have some ideas. Idea one, Stellar Nexus with a short idea. Idea two, Quantum Odyssey. Spacefaring civilization encounters a mysterious alien artifact that grants them the ability to harness quantum technology, enabling instantaneous travel across the cosmos. As they journey to revel the artifact's secrets, they uncover ancient cosmic truth that challenge the understanding of reality. Or idea number three. Yes, and you know I chose an idea number one. <laughs> number two, number two. My goodness, it is Sunday. So, Chachi was says, hey, excellent choice. So now let's go step three, character development. So you see, if I, I'm no writer at all, I have never written a science fiction story in my life. And you know this, if you have seen my channel. So I, I, I think it's great that I have some guidance, you know. So step three, character development. So we need a cast of compelling characters. <laughs> all could be copies of myself, no, <clears throat> to bring the story to life. So let's start by developing the main characters. And we have Captain Emilia Drake, yeah. A brilliant and determined space explorer who leads the expedition. She is driven by a sense of wonder and the desire to uncover the mysteries of the universe. Yes, 
Dr. Marcus Vega, a physicist responsible for deciphering the alien technology. What a coincidence. And so it goes on. With these characters in mind, we'll proceed to step four, plot the structure. We'll outline the major plot points and events that will drive the narrative forward. Are you ready to delve into the block? And I say, let's go, let's go, yippee! <laughs> ChatGPT comes back and says, hey, fantastic! Now, step number four, plot structuring for our science fiction sort short story. Here's an outline of major plot points and events that will shape your science fiction short story. And it's the work is already done. I mean, I'm not creative at all in science fiction writing, but this is nice. So, okay, we have an introduction. Introduce the crew of the spaceship, encounter with the artifact. Mysterious alien artifact is encountered. Harness in quantum technology. Experiments with the artifact technology leading to breakthroughs in interstellar travel. Of course, what else? It's my story. Cosmic revelation as the groove dives deeper, yes. Conflict and consequences. Differences in interpreting the artifact message causes conflict among the crew. So we have here the human chaos. Yippee, yippee, yay. Race against time. Yes, of course. Now the thriller comes through. A destabilizing quantum anomaly threatens to tear apart the fabric of the universe. I mean, what else? Why just restrict ourselves just to the local galaxy? And then we have the resolution in the plot structure and the epilogue. Great, the crew returns to Earth forever changed by their experiences. I think I will write a beautiful short story because ChatGPT gives me really some good guidance here. Step five, world building. We delve into the world of advanced spacefaring civilization, exploration and the intricate details of quantum technology. We explore societal implications of harnessing such power and the ethical consideration that arise. So this is the end of step four. Let me know if you have any adjustments or can we proceed to step four, step five? And I say, yeah, continue, yippee. So we are now at step five, world building. Never thought I would make a video about world building with ChatGPT, but here we are. <laughs> we'll focus on creating the details of the world in which Quantum Odyssey takes place. So what do we have? We have an interstellar society. Describe the state of the Earth civilization, mastery of space technology, transform society, culture, the spacefaring technology itself, specific of the technology that enables interstellar travel communication, the alien artifact, its appearance, its origin, the purpose of the alien artifact, what clues does the crew find? The cosmic landscape, describe the galaxies and the crew that the crew encounters during its interstellar journeys. Then we have, of course, some dilemma, some ethical dilemma. Of course, it's a science fiction story. Scientific advancements, consider the scientific advancement beyond quantum technology. What are other breakthroughs that have reshaped life on Earth? And by crafting a rich and detailed world, we enhance the depth and authenticity of our quantum odyssey short story. Feel free to add details, modifications. Great. If everything is okay, we move on to step number six. And I, I'm i now very creative and I say, continue. Yeah, now you're amazed, aren't you? So, step number six, crafting engaging scenes for the Quantum Odyssey story involves creating specific scenes, so the key scenes that bring your narrative to life and engage your readers. Here are some, or some few key scenes to consider and ChatGPT already does their work for me. I mean, this is, this is really easy. I believe I can write a science fiction story. So at first we have the artifact discovery, then we have the quantum leap. When we discover here the technology of the artifact to achieve instantaneous travel, travel across the cosmos. Then we have the decoding. Yes, we now learn the alien language. We have the first contact with advanced alien civilization. And then the trouble begin, we have here a tense situation when unintended consequences of the experiments trigger some destabilizing quantum anomaly. My goodness, then we have the conflict with the crew where we have the captain that must mediate disagreement among the crew members. Then we have the cosmic revelation. Yeah. Presents the crew with his finding on the cosmic truth hinted at by the artifact's creator. 
then we have the crisis, then we have an evolving perspective, and a final decision taken by Captain Craig. Yeah, we have to sail on. Yippee! So these scenes will provide pivotal moments of tension, discovery, character developments in your short story. Do you have any specific scenes in mind? Would you like to modify the one outlined above? And you know, now I am absolutely powered with creativity, 110% creativity, and I say continue. So we are here at step number seven, editing and refinement of what we have written so far. And I hope you have written something because currently I'm the only one talking here, but I am amazed what ChatGPT can do here, the guidelines it gives me. So yeah, editing and refinement, pacing. Are there any sections that feel rushed or too slow? <laughs> the dialogue, fine tune out the dialogue to reflect on the specific personalities of your characters. Enhance the descriptive element to paint vivid imagery of the settings, technology, cosmic landscapes, team and messages. Confirm that the themes and messages you intend to convey are effectively integrated into the narr narrative. Evaluate the growth and the transformation of the main characters. Oh, wow. Foreshadowing. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Foreshadowing. Transition. Smoothly transition between scenes and the chapters ensure that readers can follow the progression of events without confusion, like you are confused with this video here. Consistency, yes. Tension and conflict. Critical conjectures in maintaining reader interest, final touches, review the grammar, the punctuation, the formatting to ensure a polished presentation. And there we are. We have finished now our first science fiction novel. Oh, no, I still have to be creative, so I say continue. Step eight, finalizing and sharing. So this involves review, revision, title and introduction. Craft a captivating title that reflects the essence of your story. I have the same problem with each and every of my YouTube videos. Formatting and presentation, 1080p or 4K. It's, it's, it's a heavy discussion. Proofreading. You have to have the cover art, the author's note, the publication, the feedback. And then we celebrate we have created our first unique science fiction narrative that explores the mystery of the cosmos. And ChatGPT says, congratulations, it's now ready to be shared with the world. Except I have not really done my part, so I've not written here between the different tasks and finished the story. So I'm a little bit lazy and uh, <clears throat> now I recognize this and I say, can you write a short story based on this structure? And since uh, ChatGPT has been asked this a lot of and I have thousands of short stories being created, they have now some limitation. I said, hey, I'm glad you're interested in having a short story. However, due to the length limitation of conversation, I won't be able to write an entire short story here. However, and this is however, however, is always good. I can certainly provide you with a summarized version, or if you like, I can create a more detailed outline. And I go with the more detailed outline. And here we go introduction, encounter, the technology, the revelations. So I get a lot of new ideas. Epilogue. So you have here now a more detailed outline. And I say, so. What else? And I say, hey, crafting some engaging scenes, compelling dialogue, vivid description to bring the narrative to life on race against time. And I says, okay, and now ChatGPT writes here one chapter or one scene, if you want, race against time. And here we have now the scene developed here by ChatGPT. So you see, it is amazing. It is a real help. I've never written a science fiction story, but maybe today, Sunday afternoon, today it will happen. And maybe I will, yeah, why not? Be creative and write my first science fiction short story with a little bit of help, 99% of Jet GPT. I hope it was a little bit inspiring for you. You see how we can use this technology. And honestly, I never thought about this specific possibility, but I like it. Would be great to see you in my next video.